Hey everyone, it is Crystal with Pineapple Papers and I have day 10 for my December daily today. I was hoping to do 10 and 11, um, but day 10 was quite long and um, even sped up four times. I'm like, yeah, we're just gonna kind of go with it. So uh, day 10, we went and saw the Nutcracker, Julianne and I. So the first page is going to be her in front of the tree. So I have this beautiful uh, poinsettia paper in the back and I'm gonna leave the branding strip on um, and I'll explain that in a minute. I backed my photo with a lighter green plaid and I used that crepe paper. I should know it by heart, Cozy Christmas, um, to go down the side. And that kind of covers up that group of people that's right next to that tree. I did a title of Noel, and I just added a tag, a die cut Christmas tree, and then a perspective from Bramble Fox um, that is a tree as well. And then... I'm going to glue all of that on. My Nouveau Deluxe Adhesive is definitely getting to the end because it's starting to clog. I noticed that it kind of does that when, um, when it's getting to the end. So you know that hole in the branding strip for the 6 by 8 paper pads? I am going to kind of use it and put a piece of uh, trim in there. Kind of like a tag, but not as a tag. And then on the back side of that, I just went ahead and put the, oh, what are they called? Uh, screenplay, screenplay? Anyway, the book that you get um, when you go. So that's gonna go on the back. And then I have eight photos uh, of, of us, basically. Um, at the ballet. So I have four selfies and then you're not allowed to take uh, photos during the performance. But luckily when I followed at the Arizona Ballet on Instagram, they posted pictures. So I just screenshotted those pictures and I'm going to use them and I think they're perfect. So I'm going to do two pictures of Julianne and I and two screenshots per per side here. So I'm just going to embellish just a little bit. I'm not, for as long as this took me, I, I really didn't do a lot. So the top left photo, I just put a, whatchamacallit, like a label on it. And I'm gonna add the number 10 to that. And that's gonna be all I'm gonna do to that. I really wanted to get like, another floral to cover the holly that you see in that label, but I couldn't find anything. <laughs> so I just mess with it. Now the next one, I had a cut apart sheet and I, it was that red and white plaid I thought was super cute. So I put one of the screenshotted pictures on there and it's when they're dancing in the snow. So I thought it would be perfect to get a couple of snowflakes on there. And then I had one of those puffy, I think they were called center flower centers from Heidi Swap back in 2005. I had one left. Uh, it was from my How to Kill a Kit with Style for last month. So it's kind of the same color as in that label to the left of it. So I was like, perfect. So I did add the die cut word wonder to the bottom and that's gonna do it for that one. Uh, the bottom I have a cut apart sheet with a uh, ornament. I am also going to add a word sticker that says winter wonderland and another snowflake. And then on the bottom, initially, I'm just going to do a little heart die cut and a tiny word sticker that says you and me. And then I'm realizing, oh, I don't have any of that cozy Christmas paper 
So where am I going to put it? So I end up cutting it into a little banner, sticking it on that bottom photo and reapplying the tiny word sticker and the heart. And that's going to do it for that side. So got a little bit of piece of paper there, but not a ton. I have crazily struggled trying to get things in this pocket today. So I am going to basically do the same. I want to put the photos where the photos are on the other so I know it's the exact same size. And I know this card is a little smaller. So I'm going to basically glue it to the back of the other card, trim it down so they're exactly the same size. And this is a fun one. This is where the Nutcracker is fighting the uh, Mouse King. Well, in Arizona, they are not mice. They are like big rats with big butts. It was so funny. The, I know they're mice, but they look like rats and they were so funny. So we called them rats and they did a Q&A afterwards and everybody called them rats. So we're going to go with their rats. So that's the Rat King <laughs> that is fighting. So kind of funny. I just put the photo down. I'm going to add a chipboard banner, a little label sticker to do a little bit of journaling, and then a little postage stamp. And then for the actual photo pictures, I'm going to take uh, two stickers from the sticker book. One says joy that's going to go on the top right and the one on the bottom is just going to get a floral and those are done. Like they are simple, simple. So uh, again, having trouble getting pieces in. <laughs> so thank goodness it doesn't look so bad at four speed. So the last one that I am going to do, I am going to do directly on the back of that card. And I added my photo. I'm gonna add a little label sticker to the bottom with a couple of tiny words that say my favorite because this part is so funny, so funny. And then I have a floral piece. Now this floral piece I'm strategically putting up in the right upper hand corner because you could see the Arizona Ballet and the screenshot thing. So <clears throat> that being said, um, I do that. And then I put a little brad in the center of the flower. And then I'm looking for something to go up there on the top. I'm going to decide on an arrow piece that is chipboard. So that is going to do it for day 10. I hope you enjoyed this. I do have a couple of close-ups for you uh, because I did speed it up at, at times four. So these are a little slower. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. I love to chat with you. I hope to have another day tomorrow. So remember to wear your crown and we'll see you later. Bye.